everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss the IELTS writing tips for task 2. If you want to score more in IELTS writing, you must follow these tips. The first one is know the format. You should know what is the format of IELTS writing. You should know how the IELTS writing is assessed. You should know the public version of band descriptors. How the IELTS writing is assessed on four criteria. The first one for task 2 is task response. That means how you are attempting the task. Are you writing according to the topic? The second one is cohesion and coherence. It means the clear paragraphing. Your paragraph should be clear. It should be linked. How you are describing your ideas. The third one is lexical resource. In this, you must use a range of vocabulary. You are not supposed to use the same words again and again. You must use the synonyms. And the fourth one is GRA, that is grammatical range and accuracy. It means you should use wide range of sentence structure. You are not going to use the same sentences like complex or compound or simple. You are using the combination of all three and you are using it properly. The next step is you should proofread your writing. Once you're done with your writing task, you must edit it and proofread it. In this way, you can find your errors. So you should proofread your answer after completing writing task. Do not memorize your answers. We all know that in writing task 2, the essays gets repeated in real exam, but you're not going to memorize any answer in advance. Otherwise, you will be caught. You will be penalized for that. So do not write memorized answer. The next step is use formal language always. You're not going to use any abbreviation, any short form or any informal words. So write formally. Use punctuation marks carefully. Take care of comma, full stop and apostrophe. You must know where to use it and how to use it. So make sure you are using it correctly. Practice in advance about all these. Always add examples. You must add two, three examples to justify what you are writing. If you are giving an opinion in favor of the topic or you are not giving your opinion in favor of topic, always add examples to justify it. Learn from your mistakes. You should know where you are doing a mistake. So make sure you are practicing to correct it in advance. For example, take care of spellings. If you are doing the same mistake again and again, practice more. Write that word again and again and improve your spelling mistakes in advance. The next important thing is you should know that your writing is going to be checked by two independent examiners. They are going to check on the basis of criteria which I have already mentioned in this video and they are going to penalize you on three things. The one is underlined, the second one is illegible handwriting, the third one is off topic. Illegible handwriting means you are not writing legibly, they are not able to understand what you are writing. So work on your handwriting in advance. Especially in case of paper and pen exam, you should have clear handwriting. The second thing is off topic. If you are writing not according to the topic, you are going to lose marks for that. So make sure you are writing according to the topic. The third one is under length. If you are not writing 250 words, you will be penalized for that. So make sure you are writing 280 to 300 words. You must express your ideas in the exam. Do not restrict your writing according to the guidelines given by many. So make sure, write more, score more and express your opinion on that topic. So these are the important tips. So make sure you know what is task response. What is cohesion and coherence? What is lexical resource? And what is GRA? You should know all these before taking the real exam. So these are the important tips which you can follow and score more in IELTS writing. Thank you. For best IELTS coaching, join English Mentor today. We are located at Sector 34A behind Pikali Mall, Chandigarh and Leela Bhavan Patiala.